Hello everybody. In this video, we're going to go over the steps that we follow in order to set up HubSpot Action Automation for Workflows, one of our workflow apps that you're about to install within your agency and connect to your HubSpot platform and more importantly, execute actions directly from your workflow. So let's get started. At your agency view, you go at the app marketplace to search for the app. You search for HubSpot. We go, click on it. We go at install. We select this sub account where you, we want the tool to be installed. Continue. We go, we go at allow and install. We choose a plan. We confirm. Complete installation. And we automatically open this new window in order to copy the custom menu link URL. So we click here, we make sure it's copied, and then we switch to agency view in order to create a custom menu link. Remember, you create a custom menu link if this is your first time installing one of our apps. So in order to do it, you come here at settings, and then custom menu links, create new. You have to fill this form, and you start by uh, selecting an icon for your custom menu. We have different icons here. When you're done, you come here and you type a name for your custom menu link. How do you want to name your custom menu link? And here you paste the custom menu link URL that you copy. Scroll down and here you select the account where you want all the tools to be available. And here you can select whether there is a user or all the users uh, you want to give access to all the information. When you're done, you make sure you save. The next step is to switch the sub account in order to connect the tool to the herb spot platform. So let's do it. Inside the sub account, you're going to look for your custom menu link. We have our custom menu link. Remember when I asked you to choose a name for your custom menu link? Actually, we named our custom menu link for your apps. If you guys named your custom menu, my tools. Make sure you have my tools here. So we go on Greg app. We have apps available and connected apps. So let's type herb spot. It doesn't pop up here it means it's already connected so let's go and connect the apps there you go we have herb spot now let's pretend that it's not connected yet okay and we want to connect the tool to her to our herb spot platform so how do we go about it we just have to go from setup and there is a credential which is actually to provide the, the token but before we go any further you can read how to get your credentials actually if you click on it it will lead you to a smart queue showing you how to get that key but let's do it together so we're going to switch to our hubspot platform in order to do it inside hubspot you come here on the setting wheel then scroll down at the private apps let's see token you can upload the square over here description let's see test and then you will go at scopes add new scopes you check here and you check different boxes here your account is allowed to when you're done you come here i create app you're going to continue creating and you have the token you can show you copy the token you switch back you paste and you submit bingo now the tool is connected to the hubspot platform and we're able to execute actions directly from the workflow for hubspot platform so guys if you ever have any questions feel free to reach out we have a very dedicated team who's also available 24 7 to answer to all your questions if you like this video at some point, don't forget to give some thumbs up and thank you for watching.